Hey, Capricorn. Okay. So, when I was shuffling, I was getting that you could be getting the truth or mental clarity about a Leo in your life. Also, if you are going through a court situation or something with the judicial system, there's going to be less stress around that. Also, I feel like you're going to make a decision, whether it's to start something, start a business, join a group, something. It's going to really bring balance to your life. Also, I feel like you are really embodying the energy of just like not being scared to go after what you want and also to put yourself and your needs and your wants first. Because maybe it's taken you a while to actually, you know, do that and really not give a shit what other people want for you or whatever, expect of you. I really think you're going your own way, if that makes sense. So, yeah. So far we have the Nine of Swords in reverse with the Page of Cups in reverse. Maybe you are refusing an offer from someone or someone is refusing an offer from you. But with this Three of Wands, you are getting started with something that I feel like you've contemplated on doing for a really long time. I do feel like it could be a business or a job that you're applying for or um, something that you're starting, a business that you're starting. You have the Page of Swords with the Two of Swords. So this could be somebody on the outside, not sure maybe how you feel about them not sure if they should come forward and communicate with you it could be an air sign gemini libra or aquarius but i feel like you could be uncertain on whether to take an offer or someone's uncertain whether to take an offer from you so also somebody could be watching your social media watching you very closely with this page of swords here hmm. the high priest maybe you're not sure whether to commit to something or someone could be done with the Taurus. Yeah. I get more for Capricorn. Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus signs. The rest I get more for Capricorn. Yeah. Ace of Swords, you're going to be getting communication and clarity about someone or something in your life. Could be a marriage. Could be a secret that you could have felt that someone was keeping from you. You could be getting the truth about that. Hey, Bruce, maybe another card for Capricorn. Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus signs. You could be seeing 4-4 four, four a lot. That just means your angels are with you and are guiding you. So we have the Nine of Cups, so I feel like you really are going for what you wish for. You're getting it. Really focusing on yourself and your happiness. Yeah. Hey, Bruce, clarify the Nine of Swords in reverse. Really coming out of stress. Really... Um, not thinking so much about things that are not benefiting you. Thought there was a spider on me. I was about to flip the fuck out. Okay. Anyway. Universe, why is the Nine of Swords here in reverse? Why is the Nine of Swords here in reverse for Capricorn? Yeah, you're putting it into this overthinking. Could be dealing with a Scorpio or a Sagittarius, but. I feel like you're changing the way you think about something or the way you feel about something. So, why is the death card here? There's any more on the death card. Well, could be with a Pisces, Cancer, or Scorpio. That you're changing things with, maybe changing a relationship. Also, just not thinking about this person so much, not caring so much. They, they could. Okay. So, I'm getting with this offer in reverse here. <laughs> This message, you may be, be leaving them unread, not worrying about it anymore. Also, if they're traveling to see you, you might refuse to see them or refuse to like be in a relationship with them, to commit to them. You might refuse that. Okay. Clarify the Page of Cups in reverse. Let's clarify the Page of Cups in reverse. How's the Page of Cups in reverse for Capricorn? Why is the Page of Cups in reverse for Capricorn? Hmm. Nine of Wands. Yeah, I feel like this person brings more stress than like love or happiness. You're just not going for it this time. I do feel like it could be someone from the past, a past love, or someone that you've tried to have. Oh my god, <laughs> what is that? Um, tried to have a relationship with. 
can clarify the three of wands. Let's clarify the three of wands. Two of swords. Yeah, I feel like you could be debating on whether you want to communicate with this person. Knight of swords. So, why is the two of swords here? Why is the two of swords here? Also, I feel like you don't know why they could be coming back into your life. You uh, you're don't know why. So, verify the two of swords. Yeah, six of cups. You're not sure why this person's coming back. Past love relationships. Also, the X card. I feel like you don't know what their intentions are, and you're just not fucking with it. So, by the Page of Swords. Why is the Page of Swords here for Capricorn? Why is the Page of Swords here for Capricorn? Okay. So they could be telling you that they love you. You have the two of cups that they still feel a connection with you. So clarify the queen, king of pentacles, with the page of swords. Could be another Taurus, Virgo, or Capricorn that you're dealing with. I really do feel like this is a past person though. Whatever happened, it was not successful and it brought a lot of just bullshit. Yeah, they're telling you that they could regret what happened. Five of Cups with the Six of Wands. They want to try this again. They could see you being very successful, whatever you're working on, you know, with work. That you could be on social media or they just see you really happy and really successful without them. Yeah. Let's clarify the Two of Swords. What is the Two of Swords here for Capricorn? It's pentacles with the two of pentacles. Yeah, you're not sure if this offer is solid enough for you to take. And you might just cut it out of your life. Queen of Swords. Clarify right. justice. It was clarified justice. Eight of Swords. Hmm. Someone could be fearing to tell you the truth about maybe something that went on or what truly happened between you guys or how they truly feel. You could be seeing 8-8 eight, eight a lot, which means abundance is coming your way. So that could really be a kind of a sign to focus on work. And we do have the Ace of Pentacles, so abundance could definitely be coming your way. Okay. Clarify the Eight of Swords. Let's clarify the Eight of Swords for Capricorn. Hmm. Yeah, you could be scared they're still on their bullshit. Seven of Swords. Hmm. Or you could just be scared that it's not going to go, you know, how you want it to go. Or like it's not going to go good or just something. Clarify about the High Priestess? Or let's clarify the High Priestess. There could be a Taurus in your life. Okay. Hmm. I feel like you're just really committed to your work right now. You don't want any fighting. You don't want any conflict. You don't want any disappointment. You're just strictly focused on work and, you know, having this Ace of Pentacles, having a lot of money, a lot of abundance, a lot of stability. Yeah. Clear by the Ace of Swords. Yeah, so why is the Ace of Swords here for Capricorn? Could be getting some devastating news from anybody or some concerning news. So, clarify the Ace of Swords. Hmm. Yeah, news that maybe either one, take a lot of stress off of you, take a lot of worry off of you. Could be from a Virgo. Okay. Clarify the Ten of Wands with the Ace of Swords. Reverse why is the Ten of Wands here with the Ace of Swords? Oh well, okay. Okay, let's 
Let's try that again. Okay, so why is the Ten of Wands here with the Ace of Swords? Hmm. Okay, so, yeah, you could be getting, yeah, I feel like this is going to really lighten whatever news this is. It could be from a job or from a person. It could be from an Aquarius, but I feel like this is going to really bring you a lot of hope. Whatever this news is, it's going to bring you a lot of hope in whatever situation whether it's a court situation or situation with the ex or a current relationship this is going to bring you a lot of hope so if you're waiting on a message it's going to be a good one it'll feel like just a sigh of relief and it's something that you want something that you wanted to hear whether it's regarding work if you're getting the promotion or something it's something that you wished for something that you wanted to hear you're going to be hearing it so by the nine of cups and that's why is the nine of cups here for capricorn why is the nine of cups here for capricorn my bad the motherfucking camera died no. anyway okay why is the nine of cups here for capricorn and why is the nine of cups here for capricorn Hmm. Page of Swords, yeah, a message that you want to hear. Clarity, the truth about something that you've been wondering about or just waiting for someone to come clean for a while or this could be just some good news. So, anyways, what is the advice for Capricorn regarding the spread? What is the advice? Okay, that is a lot. What is the advice for Capricorn regarding this friend? Hmm. Three of Swords. Okay, so definitely something needs to be let go of. Some healing needs to happen. But with the Star card here, that's definitely what's going to be happening for you. So I'm getting with this. Allow yourself to hear. Allow yourself to. I don't know. Really know the truth and really just come into your energy so you can like move forward whatever this is the advice is definitely move forward from it and it's almost like i don't know be your best self is what i'm getting with this we have the uh, the queen of earth which is you guys so be your best self do what you want to do which i feel like that energy is already here for you and you're already doing that but i'm really getting commit to yourself okay. Let's make one more card of advice for capricorn hmm justice card okay so yeah allow yourself to know the truth don't i'm always getting let go with this it's like definitely let go whatever you're holding on to whatever let go and then just be your best self so anyway i hope this was a good reading for you capricorn if you would like a personal reading there's information down below on how to get one and yeah enjoy the rest of your week